All right. By popular demand, here is the answer to my favorite induction question. If you don't remember the exact riddle, I recommend you go watch the video. But in case you watched the video recently, here's a quick refresher. There's a hundred blue-eyed people on the island, a hundred red-eyed people on the island. One day, the white dragon comes and says that at least one of you has blue eyes. And then the question is, what happens next? Who gets to ride that dragon to freedom? Note that it's not at all obvious how to even approach solving this question, except that I've told you that this is an induction question. So rather than focusing on the fact that there's a hundred blue people and a hundred red people, why don't we ask a simpler question? What if there was just one blue person and say 199 red people? What would happen in this case when the dragon says, at least one of you has blue eyes? It's pretty obvious, right? This person who has blue eyes he or she is going to look at everyone else, say, oh, they all have red eyes, but the dragon said that someone has blue eyes, so I must have blue eyes. And what this means is the blue-eyed person figures out what color his eyes are and then leaves the next day. That one's pretty easy. So let's up the stakes a little bit. What if now there's two blue-eyed people and then 198 red-eyed people? So now what happens after the dragon says that at least one of you has blue eyes? Let's think about this from the perspective of one of the blue-eyed people. So let's say this, this blue-eyed person is called, I don't know, Yugi. And then let's say this blue-eyed person is called, I don't know, Pegasus. So let's think about this from Yugi's point of view. Yugi hears the dragon say, at least one of you has blue eyes. And then he looks around, and then he sees that, well, Pegasus has blue eyes, and there's 198 extras who also have red eyes. This means that Yugi knows that there's either one or two blue-eyed people on the island, because either Pegasus is the only one with blue eyes, or both Pegasus and himself have blue eyes. So the next thing that Yugi realizes is that if Pegasus is the only blue-eyed person, then because of this case up here, Pegasus will leave the following day. So what's the only thing Yugi can do? He waits the next day and sees if Pegasus leaves or not. Okay, let's rewind for a second. Pegasus is thinking the exact same thing about Yugi. Pegasus waits a whole day to see if Yugi is going to leave the next day. That is, if Yugi realizes that he's the only blue-eyed person. So you can imagine the two of them just sitting there the whole day staring at each other until the very next sunrise when the, when the dragon comes again. And then Yugi and Pegasus look into each other's eyes and they're just waiting to see if the other person will say that they have blue eyes. But of course they don't because they're just sitting there waiting. So then the dragon leaves. Nobody has said anything. So then Yugi realizes, aha, Pegasus was waiting for me to say something too. That must mean that I also have blue eyes. And Pegasus thinks the exact same thing. And now, after that day has passed, Yugi and Pegasus both realize they have blue eyes. And so the following day, they both leave. And from even just these two small cases, the pattern becomes pretty obvious. If there are k blue-eyed people, they all leave after k days. And maybe I should sketch this a little bit. So here's my K blue-eyed people. Let's pick one of them and call this person Kaiba. You know, K for Kaiba. And what is Kaiba thinking after the dragon says, at least one of you has blue eyes? Well, he looks around. He sees K minus one people with blue eyes. So this means there have to be either K minus one blue-eyed people or K blue-eyed people on the island. 
he knows that if there are only k minus 1 blue-eyed people, then they'll all leave after k minus 1 days. So what does he do? He sits there quietly and waits for k minus 1 days. And on the k minus 1th day, he watches the k minus 1 blue-eyed people and tries to see if they're going to leave or not. But of course, all the other k minus 1 blue-eyed people are thinking the exact same thing. So no one leaves and then they realize that they're all waiting for the same thing and so they all have blue eyes and on the next day, the kth day Kaiba and all the other people ride that white dragon to freedom thanks for watching and have a great day